A wizard prince, an American idol. What do Harry Potter and Carrie Underwood have in common? She's burning up the charts. He's been number one at the box office. And tonight, they're together in Dateline's Hot Zone. I just make an announcement. The setting is the same. So are the names. Harry Potter! But the kids, oh, how they've changed. Harry Potter and his friends face their usual challenges in the Goblet of Fire. But the toughest one by far is adolescence. Bloody hell. I don't know if maybe you want to go to the ball with me. Sorry, I didn't catch that. He's this incredibly fantastic dragon battling, all conquering kind of hero. And it is absolutely rubbish with girls, which is fantastic. Daniel Radcliffe, who was just 11 when he first waved his wand, is now a ripe old age of 16 and having to steer Harry through those awkward teenage years. A lot of guys, you know, myself included, um, completely included, you know, have this thing of thinking, oh, I must be pretty suave with the ladies. And you're not at all when you're 15. Because you kind of see other guys using chat-up lines. And it's like, well, no, that sounds horrible and cheesy and awful. But they seem to work. And I don't understand how that is. Like what kind of a line? Well, I suppose the classic one is, I've lost my number, can I have yours? <laughs> you see, and that's probably how I would say it. And it just wouldn't work. We can do this. The three of us can figure it out. Try telling that to Ron Weasley, played by 17-year-old Rupert Grint. Ron goes through a major bout of teenage moodiness. He had some bad experiences asking out this particular girl, Fleur Delacour. <laughs> you better get her name this, right. <laughs> yeah, this French girl. It's Fleur Delacour. The French girl turns him down. Well, who am I? Oh, girl. But as any true Harry Potter fan knows, Ron's heart secretly lies with Hermione Granger, who looks just a little bit different in this movie. It's her kind of duckling into a swan kind of moment. 15-year-old Emma Watson likes the new swan. It's difficult enough to figure out how to grow up in private, let alone on the big screen. But so far, these young stars appear to be navigating it all just fine.